I don't know if she wants to be on camera. No. Oh, hey, Bunny, where'd you go? Bunny. Bunny, come on. Come on. Where'd you go? Hi. No? You don't, you don't want to be on camera. That one doesn't want to be on camera. None of our bunnies want to be on camera. They're not camera bunnies. How about Moo Bunny? No Moo Bunny? Come on, Moo Bunny. Come here. Come here. Oh. What are you doing? You eating, Moo Bunny? She's eating. Moo Bunny's eating. Yep. Oh, hey. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there she is. If she wiggles her nose, she's happy. Right, Mom? Yes, there's twins. Moo Bunny twins. Mom's not talking to us. Okay. You are not allowed to touch the bunnies. No. You're shivering, too. You're shivering. Trying to chase bunnies and cats. I thought she was talking to herself. Because she wasn't talking to me. I was trying to talk to her. But she was talking to Moo. I bought a new heated bucket, a rubber one. <laughs> The rubber one's kind of nice because if they don't, if they decide not to heat, they're not going to crack. But uh, I left it in the truck and man, did the truck stink. Smelled nasty. Like rubber tire like this. Yes, yeah, so we're going to go hook this up because somebody's bucket is heated. It uh, doesn't look broken, but it's also not working. So I don't know what the problem is, but that's what we're going to go do with this bucket. Oh, that's to try to stop the, it's frozen now, frozen. That was to try to stop the water from going in. Okay, okay. Piper, leave the bunnies alone. Yeah, it's either cats or bunnies, one of the two. She, uh, Gus, I hear you. Yeah. Start with Gus, first thing, they're that cranky. Okay. Yeah. You guys need coffee? Is that what it is? No? Not a coffee issue, is it? All right, we're gonna get to work out here. You just let Sadie out? Yep. You treated that one? I let Sadie out because she likes to have her babies early. Well, this is true. And I own the place. Uh, that, yeah, <laughs> I guess that's why. Yeah. <laughs> and, so. Still mad at you for getting me all wet. Oh, go ahead. You gonna educate? No. Oh. Moo's so fat I can't feel her babies. <laughs> oh, I felt Moo's babies, I think, the other day. Really? I think I felt They're something. probably sleeping, but she has such thick skin. Let's yeah. just call it that. Yeah, thick skin. That's thick what skin. it is. It's not fluff. Sadie's babies, like, they're they're right here. But Sadie's a little, th like, a lot thinner. So. Let's get the top-down shot for Sadie. Okay. Looks like she's not pregnant. Like, right, she's not so too big. So she's not that big, but she's also only ultrasounded to have one baby this year. Super active baby. It's right here. Feel kicking, and yeah. I've been able to feel kicking now for. You probably a won't be able to see now. anything though. Well, if you see anything, it's going to be right in here. But the baby is not really strong enough to make visible kicks yet. Right. Still early. Still really early. But I'm feeding her her grade. Remember, they can have grade four to six weeks before their due date. Right. The four weeks is in four days. Right. So you're at She's like five weeks. She's already in the four to six window. So yep. I choose to give her her grain a little early just based on her history of delivering five days early. Mm. Definitely getting busy around here. We're back to two stands now. So we can feed grain in the morning. Harper was the last one. So they're getting the grain you heard her. Four to five weeks, six weeks, or whatever, pre-babies. We're at about four or five weeks. So they're starting. 
and it'll just get busier and busier as we get closer because they'll just more will get grain and then we'll start setting up kidding stalls and it'll just get crazy around here this is going to house of pie news to me i just found out i got fired again so i don't know when i'll see you guys all i know is i gotta finish the brakes on my car Tyler, are you there? Oh, yeah, he is. He's back there somewhere. Yeah, we give up. Yeah, so that comment I made about mechanics, maybe in this video or earlier, telling you guys, I got this. Yeah, I don't have it. Three days later, uh, Tyler, I'm going to need my light back. Turn it back on. We got the wheels done. The I mean, the brakes are done. Shine that light back under here on this stupid oil change bolt. There. There, I need it a little more this way. Where? So we can see the bolt. I don't know. I don't know which you don't know where to go? I don't know which way to go. Okay, right there. Stop. Right there. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. We can see it right there. Super stripped. There, give oh, me one sec. Oh, my there, goodness. There, that's brighter. I even tried to carve a groove into the side of hey, it. Hey, that was my idea. Well, no, into the side. Your idea was to turn it into a flathead screwdriver. But we tried to carve a groove into the side so we can ratchet onto it, so we can vice grip onto it. The problem is, like I was trying to tell young lad here. Yeah, you, young lad. Hang on, where is everybody? Where is everyone? Where, where, I can't see. Okay. Yeah, we're working. Don't worry, I have safety stands too. See, we have safety stands. We have, but because we're working on the floor in snow dripping off onto my head and it's very tough to work under here we just can't get that bolt off we can't do it i'm gonna turn off this light so we me. no we surrender Fine. um i'm done no more oil change we'll figure it out later but we'll, ha we'll have to have a mechanic do it for us we actually bought a new new bolt to replace this one yeah we just can't get it off no so we're done right Tyler? Next you know they're gonna say, i'm just gonna can't get it off just scrap the motor scrap the motor oh stop it we're just, just gonna run it until it dies. We're just gonna put music on and like start cleaning the garage. That's what we're gonna do. We are. Oh yeah, lunchtime actually. That's a good idea. Oh yeah, lunch time. Time to eat lunch. And then I'm, and then I'm going to okay, bye. His butt's frozen and it's official. We're done. Well, not done. I mean, we still have more. But look at how clean we made it. Look, look. We gotta get rid of that bag. That bag was a bad purchase. Peat moss. I bought way too much peat moss. Look at that. So now we have room to get Green Machine into the garage and start the rebuild Please. process. So what? Yeah, I think Jake found out. I think he found out. He did. He, did. he, he figured it out. He watched the first video, but didn't have access to the second hidden video. And then he tore it out of us during a call where he was like really good and stuff he opened up and we shared that green machines getting a little bit of repairs done so he figured it out he doesn't know what's happening oh, and we're not going to tell him so no more details but we're going to work on it because now we've got room so now i'm going to do the barn and go to bed actually i'm going to do the barn and eat yeah okay mom i think is starting the oven but um going don't forget to close this door and make sure the heater's off we don't want to leave the heater on that'd be a bad thing okay this day's over. Good night.
<laughs> Putting the blade in will help. <laughs> 